Hello everyone. Are you curious about whether a fish can live in both saltwater and freshwater? Let's find out. While most fish species are adapted to either freshwater or saltwater environments, there are some species known as urahaline fish that can tolerate a wide range of salinities and live in both freshwater and saltwater habitats. These fish have specialized physiological adaptations that allow them to osmoregulate and maintain proper internal salt concentrations regardless of the external environment. Urahaline fish are typically found in estuarine environments, where freshwater rivers meet the ocean. Estuaries experience fluctuating salinity levels due to the mixing of freshwater and saltwater, making them challenging environments for many aquatic organisms. However, urahaline fish can thrive in estuaries by adjusting their osmoregulatory mechanisms to cope with changing salinity conditions. One example of a urahaline fish is the Atlantic salmon, Salmosala, which is known for its ability to migrate between freshwater rivers and the ocean during different stages of its life cycle. Atlantic salmon juveniles hatch in freshwater rivers, where they spend the first few years of their lives before migrating to the ocean to feed and grow. When it's time to spawn, adult salmon return to freshwater rivers to reproduce, completing their life cycle. Another example is the urahaline killifish, which can be found in both freshwater and saltwater habitats throughout the world. These fish have evolved various physiological adaptations, such as specialized ion transport mechanisms in their gills and kidneys, to regulate their internal salt concentrations and survive in different salinity environments. While urahaline fish can tolerate a wide range of salinities, their ability to thrive in both freshwater and saltwater habitats may depend on factors such as species-specific adaptations, environmental conditions, and life history strategies. Nonetheless, their versatility in adapting to changing salinity conditions makes them important members of estuarine ecosystems and valuable subjects for scientific research on osmoregulation and adaptation. Thank you for watching. Please follow for more related videos and see you later. Goodbye.